Hello and welcome to another marvelous video. We're back to talk about more dragons. The most deadly weapons available to the Targaryens are dragons. They can cook a man alive, are giants, and wreck great destruction. We gained more knowledge about the lives and behaviors of dragons from House of the Dragon, and we even had the opportunity to observe a few significant dragons in the past. In today's video, we will throw massive dragons against one another. We're referring to Balerion and Vermithor. One dragon passed away from old age, while another perished in a brutal three-way fight. So who is the larger and stronger of Vermithor? and Balerion. Stick with us to find out. Balerion vs. Vermithor In his era, Balerion was at his peak, capable of terrifying almost anybody. He was the most enormous dragon the Targaryens had ever possessed. His extended existence allowed him to grow to incredible proportions. Balerion was said to be so huge that the shadow of his wings could engulf entire villages. He had jaws big enough to consume entire aurochs and hairy mammoths. The sheer sight of Valerian kept the lords of the Seven Kingdoms from even considering revolt. In terms of size, Vagar was the only dragon that came close to Valerian. She may have overtaken him if she hadn't perished in the battle above the god's eye. When it comes to Vermithor, he was briefly renowned as the largest living tamed dragon following Vagar's death. His very lengthy lifespan allowed him to grow to a larger size than other dragons. Vermithor was a massive dragon who spent most of his existence without a rider. Vermithor refused all future riders within his inaugural rider, Jaehaerys the First Targaryen died. New Hammer, a dragon seed blacksmith, ultimately mounts him. Now that we have compared their sizes, let's talk about their strength. What can be said about Balerion's strength that hasn't already been stated? Balerion's dragon fires were hot enough to melt stone and the walls of Harrenhal glowed like candles in his presence. Balerion was by far the most powerful dragon Targaryen had ever possessed. His fangs were so long that they might be compared to swords. More than 4,000 soldiers were burnt during Aegon's conquest by the three dragons, Meraxes, Vagar, and Balerion. Balerion was no longer as powerful at the end of his life, yet his legacy lingered on. Vermithor's strength is unknown, save for the fact that he was a dangerous and enormous dragon. Vermithor, sometimes known as the Bronze Fury, was an obstinate dragon that refused all riders after Jaehaerys I Targaryen died. He vowed to set fire to them all. His life ended at the age of 100 when his rider Hugh Hammer switched sides, betrayed Rhaenyra, and joined the Greens. Vermithor was killed in a battle between three dragons, however, he defeated both Sea Smoke and Tessarion. Vermithor was overwhelmed in size and power by Balerion. For a brief time, Vermithor was the biggest live tamed dragon, but Balerion is still the biggest dragon that has ever been recorded in terms of size. Balerion possessed dragon fire that could really melt stone when it came to power. Vermithor was a powerful dragon, yet his fire and mass paled compared to Balerion the Black Dread. Vermithor's battle would be easier if Tessarion wasn't around to join the fight. Sea Smoke was an obvious target for him because of his age, size, and power. Whatever Vermithor's objective strength was, no dragon alive at the time could stand his ground as well as Vermithor did against two other dragons. Unfortunately, Vermithor did not fare as well. In a scary display of strength, he ripped Seat Smoke heads off. Even if he had survived his injuries, he would have been unable to fly again because his wings had been destroyed. Marvelous Verdict between Balerion and Vermithor, with everything stated, it is obvious who the winner is. Balerion was a famous fierce of dragon who conquered the entire country. Only because Vagar died did Vermithor become the largest tamed dragon at the time. And while he managed to hold his own against two other dragons, it's unclear how he'd do against Balerion. This bout had an obvious winner. When contrasted to Vermithor, Balerion was definitely the superior dragon. No other dragon has been reported as possessing dragon fire as hot as Balerion's or fangs as terrible as his. If you enjoyed watching, then click on the like and share button. Also, remember to comment what you thought about this video. I'll see you in the next one.